First of all, our capo is going on the fifth fret. As always, when you've stuck a capo on, check your tuning. Start with, it's a G minor chord, but we're using a D minor shape because we've got the capo on. So obviously we need this D minor shape. So your first finger's going here. Ring finger's gonna go on the third fret on the B string and your middle finger can go down on the second fret on the G string. And we're gonna do something like this. Then we're going to drop our little finger down here. So you're keeping these three fingers there. Little finger comes down on the fourth fret, fourth frets up from your capo. So one, two, three, four. <laughs> it's a four G. So you got your middle finger on the three frets up from your capo. So it's a G shape, but the actual chord is a C. And then to lead into the verses, you're going to go. So third fret on the from you're already doing a G chord, so you're going to a G shape. So you're going to do this three frets up on the low E, and then open on your A string and then you're into this this shape here which is an E flat chord because that note is E flat or if you're not happy with the bar with barring or you could do uh, just your first finger there and then these three uh, then these three fingers can go three frets up on those ones, so on the B, the G and the D string. And then you're going to do a C shape, which is this one there. <laughs> and then I'll, in the interest of keeping it simple and avoiding bar chords for you, I'm going to do this G minor here, so we can go. And if you want to, you could add your first finger down here. Shit they want from me I just wanna stay 